Hello, I'm Richard from Town Valley Aquatics and in this video I'm going to show you the correct procedure for releasing your fish when you've had them delivered by overnight delivery. If you follow the steps in this video, your fish will find it a lot easier to make the transition from our tanks traveling overnight and being introduced into your tank. The more gradually you do everything, the better. So follow these steps and you'll be okay. Releasing the fish into your tank is a process that really you can't rush. The slower you do it, the better. First stage is to unpackage the fish, put them in the tank, making sure you leave the bags closed, and let them float for 20 minutes, half an hour or so, until the water in the bag becomes the same temperature as the water in the tank. Once they're floated for half an hour or so, and the water temperature has equalized between the bag and the tank, you can cut the top, roll the sides down, and put a little bit of water in out of your tank. Basically fill the bag up with water out of your tank. Because you've rolled the sides down, there'll be air trapped around here, and the bag should float upright. By doing this, it allows the fish in the bag to gradually get used to the conditions in your tank. You can leave it like this for up to an hour. In fact, with delicate species like discus, uh, some of the dwarf epistogrammas and so on, it's best to leave it as long as you can. But you know, anywhere between half an hour, three quarters of an hour or so is fine. You might find that for whatever reason, Sometimes the bag tips over and the fish just swim out themselves but you've given them a good start anyway because you've let it float for half an hour or so the temperatures equalize between the, the bag and the tank and if they swim out of their own accord then they're obviously quite happy so don't worry about it too much. Final stage of your fish introduction once they've floated with the mixed water for anything up to an hour is to gently tip the bag up moving it backwards and forwards or up and down allowing the water to mix in and out of the bag you'll find that the fish might just swim out themselves or will come out with a little persuasion if you just lift the bag up a bit If you didn't want to add the water that was in the bag to your tank, you can always gently net the fish out once they've stood with the mixed water for anything up to an hour. Thanks for watching this video. I just hope that there's some of the staff from the local garden centre near us uh, watch it and take some of the advice on board. Because what they tend to do is just get the fish in. They may have travelled one, two, three days, maybe it's more, and uh, get them imported. They put them on the ground in the bags, get a bucket with a net over the top, pull the net over the top of the bucket, tip the bags straight in. The fish are all flapping around together in the net. And lash them straight in the tanks which isn't really the way to go so hopefully by following the advice in this video you'll now know how to do it thanks for watching